This is the Umbrado truck bed mattress. So this is a five and a half foot bed. This is a 2019 Ford Raptor that I have. And I want to show you guys what the setup process looks like and also how it fits. I haven't camped on it yet. I literally just took it out of the box. I want to show you a test fit. It. It's uh, like 90 degrees outside, so it's way too hot to lay down in the bed in the sun, but I'm going to try this out as soon as I can. But in the box, we have two little pillows, which I don't know if I'll ever use. We have the mattress itself. It comes with an air pump and a carrying case. The one thing with the air pump is the cable is a little bit short if you don't have an outlet in the back of your truck. So what I did is I opened the rear window. I ran it through there and actually had to flip the mattress around to pump it and then flip the mattress. Not the biggest deal, but I would have loved a battery pump, a rechargeable pump, or a much longer cable so it could actually run to the rear seats of my truck. Okay, so now that you've seen that, let me show you the fit. And what's important with a truck bed mattress is that it has cutouts, or rather indents, for the wheel wells. Because if you're just trying to put a regular blow-up mattress that you buy at a department store or online, it's not going to fit because you have the bumps right there, or it's not going to fit comfortably, rather. So this one is made exactly for this bed. As you can see, it fits right there. I do have a tonneau cover on my bed, which is why you have that shadow there, which of course I would take off for actual camping. You can see that it fits really well. It goes right up to the edges. You can see the tailgate right here. So it fits really nicely. We have the pump on this side. It deflates really quickly also. Let me show you, I can also put my tailgate up so you can actually just close this up for the day. If you're camping for multiple days, you wanna close the truck, you can do that, no problem at all. So I have the step in my truck. If you guys know the Ford trucks, you have seen these steps before. So I'm gonna pop this guy down. Here we go. It's nice on a big lifted truck like this. And we're just gonna close that up. And there we go. You can see that the mattress still fits. I could totally drive like this, or I could just leave it out for the day. Um, it's not recommended if it's super hot because there are certain temperature ranges that you're supposed to use this in, but I think it's up to like 170 degrees Fahrenheit, so it should be fine. And then again, you can see that fit when I open this. It fits perfectly, just a tiny bit dirty there, but that's easy to clean off. And that is the Umbr Auto mattress. You can see I don't have it fully inflated here just because I want to test fit it. I, I know I'm not going to lay on it right now, so I just keep inflating it. And I'll show you that if you open just the outside part of the valve, it doesn't deflate, which is nice. So you don't have to worry about like filling it up and then you have to close it as fast as you possibly can so that it doesn't lose air. It's totally fine. You just close it on your own time. Then when you want to deflate it, just open the middle part. You'll hear it'll start to deflate a little bit. There you go. And then you can use the pump to actually reverse and deflate. So you can suck everything out, or you can do the old school method, just push it out. There you go. So that is the first look at the Umbr Auto mattress for the five and a half foot truck bed here in the 2019 Ford Raptor.